What's up guys, it's the Saints fan, and we are here on the PC, uh, and I'm going to be doing a Halloween car show. Hopefully these guys, I see some uh, some of the new low riders. we got some of the new Halloween cars as well, and uh, yeah, it should be pretty good. So, you may be wondering why we're on PC and not Xbox One, or the console, or any other console for that matter. One, I'm banned on PS4, and uh, you know, I'll cut to a little clip here of the Xbox One car show, and you can just see how that went. To start off, now the next one, Zentorno. I I told it, and it's gonna rain. You know, is this just a tradition? The first car show when I stream, it just rains. I it might be. We got some people who actually want to cooperate this time, so uh, hopefully this works. Anyway, we're gonna hop into this as I get stabbed. So as we run back, I just want to say that since uh, we're on the Xbox One, I mean the lag box one, as you can see, I don't know why it's lagging. I, apparently that's a normal thing that happens. That's not my capture card, which is a surprising uh, thing. Anyway, not sure about those rims. Those are like sport rims. I mean, it doesn't look bad, but maybe some orange rims would have been nice. And we can't do it, can we? No, it's just, it's never going to work. The dream is over. I've already accepted this. This one's orange with this, uh, the, the library that has a ton of colors. We've got the pink, purple, yellow, death apparently. That's cool. So. What, that card? This game's haunted. Anyway. That is it with the car show. This does go on YouTube. I don't know. We'll see. So yeah, as you saw, it, it's not that great. We're just going to get right into this, though. We only got 15 people, but these cars do look pretty cool, at least at a glance. So Mr. Danky got the voodoo here. Got the orange on the top. This is actually not a custom one either. It's like the worn down one. Got the orange on the top. Got the purple on the bottom with the orange rims. You know, it, it's pretty nice. Uh, obviously, for a non-custom voodoo. Orange and purple kind of go together. And I honestly, honestly, I like the uh, like the worn down look as well. So it's nice, nice way to start it off. Mick, Mick, wait, what? Mick Spider Pick. He's got the uh, the moonbeam. Now look, he actually took my advice and didn't put the freaking speakers, like all the speakers in his door. But this is nice, man. Nice orange and black theme, obviously. Got orange on the outside with all the black and like skulls and stuff on the writing. Orange lights on the bottom, black rims with the white walls. I love the interior though. This is this is awesome. You got the uh, the black and the orange, nice. Uh, Comp or contrast there not the big speakers in the back either you got the smaller ones too so uh so far do pretty good this next one this is the chino from this guy another black and orange thing this one's pretty cool as well he's got the black the orange lines for the library with the <laughs> the tiger stripes on the inside here's the back Got the speakers back here with the hydraulics. He's got the, the three... I don't know what wheels they're technically called, but... Uh, you got the black rims with the white walls there. And here is his engine. Pretty cool. This next one, this one's mine, actually. This is the Lurcher. And I put a... I think it's a matte orange with a white pearlescent. Obviously, with that livery. We got orange on the rims. And uh, I, I like the way this one came out because I like the uh, the white that the pearlescent gives it to match sort of like the the smoke and the mistiness, cloudiness of that library. Moving to a layer, he's got the Frankenstein. Now this one is orange and purple. Now the only downside to this car is that the interior is always purple. You can't change that, which kind of sucks. But obviously he he's making the best because he has the purple flames. You got the orange rims with the white walls, and then obviously orange everywhere else. And like I said, over there, orange and purple kind of go together. Now this next one, I was just explaining to the people on my stream. This one actually looks pretty cool. One, because it's not like the regular orange and black that you would see. This one is green and purple. And it reminds me of like, uh, and I don't know if this makes sense to anyone else, but it reminds me of like the, uh, like a witch's like pot of, of acid or like they're you know you ever see and they're like stirring up their mystical pot that's what it kind of reminds me of maybe that's just me 
obviously though again the purple matching the purple in the inside then he's got the black rims pretty cool that Kingsman he's got the Buccaneer here now I'm not sure how Halloween Halloweeny is that a I don't know if that's a word this is got the purple and then like the gold as the trim with the green on the inside i mean it looks nice I'm not not really sure it's halloween theme though uh by the way for the people that are just joining if you guys want to hurry up and get over here you can join as well moving on to one of those people we got another frankenstein now this one is black with the red flames and then he's got purple as a secondary to match the purple in the inside not bad there pretty simple and white on the rims as well but yeah, pretty simple. Honestly, there's not much you can really do with uh, with that car. <laughs> now, Desire, he's got a coil. This is an interesting, uh, interesting choice here. So he's got, obviously, matte orange as the primary. He's got black as the secondary. He's got the black and orange on the rims as well. For a car that you can't really customize that much, pretty cool. Another Frankenstein from this guy, Rust. This one is a darker, it's like a blackish orange. Got the cobwebs on this one as well, with the orange on the bottom, and then orange on the rims. Pretty nice. One of those people with the orange and purple again on the, then we have one of these, yeah, we have one of these down there. This one's a little bit different because his rims are a little bit different. Plus this one is metallic. I think the other one was matte pretty nice <laughs> this guy like took my idea with the orange and white on the lurcher although he has green rooms kind of changing it up a little bit not bad there you guys yo you guys can like go over here there's there's more room <laughs> you guys don't need to cram up nolan another lurcher here this one is just black and white you guys want to close your doors that'd be nice again just black and white Fairly simple. All hack, how hack, whatever. Another Frankenstein. This one is red and silver. So this one's a little bit different. It's not really Halloween themed, but it is one of the Halloween cars. So to be honest, this isn't actually that bad. I mean, besides the purple in the interior, not really matching this, like the chrome or the, the metal that you have or silver, whatever it is matched with the red. It looks really nice. Can, like, and especially that it matches, like, all the engine parts as well. And I just noticed he actually has the cobweb on his, so it's minimalistic uh, for his library. Sayar with the, the voodoo. He's got a dark blue with this, this light blue library, and then he has orange and white on the inside. And then orange money rims for the wheels. Now, it doesn't... You know, it actually kind of, the more I look at it, it kind of goes together. I mean, it's not amazing, but kind of goes together. One of those, I think it's Brendan's car. This one is the orange voodoo with a bunch of colors here. You got purple, you got some black, you got some yellow, and then orange on the rims. And then actually orange on the uh, inside for the lights and then purple on the inside, purple and black to be more specific. I mean, it looks cool. Again, I'm not exactly sure it's fitting the Halloween theme. Another Frankenstein. This one seems to be a popular car. You got blue with the orange flames. It's all right. Muberto. Again, this one's not really a Halloween theme. It's just blue with the white and blue or black interior. And yeah, not bad looking, but not really, not really what we're going for. Is that? It might be everyone's car. I don't know if anybody else was late. This is a late addition to the party. I just want to throw this in here. This is another Frankenstein. This one's actually pretty neat. So he's got the purple flames. Is it like a dark blue, dark purple as the primary and then purple on the rim. So not, uh, not too shabby there, my dude. Not too bad. All right. We're in a new location, but this is another late comer to the uh, car show. And uh, I wanted to show this one because it's actually pretty cool. So it's got the uh, or it's the Frankenstein with the cobwebs. And it's got like a, the white, obviously, but it's like a silver. So it's, uh, it's pretty cool. Or like a, a dark gray. 
Anyway. Okay, so it looks like that's everyone. No, my favorites. This guy is for sure. Um, I honestly, the moonbeam looked pretty cool as well. Definitely this green and purple Frankenstein. Stange? I, I don't think I'll ever say that correctly. And, um... Even though it's not really the colors aren't themed, obviously the car is themed. Uh, that one's pretty cool. So uh, those are my favorite. I know we didn't have a full lobby, unfortunately. What is this but uh, maybe next time on console, people will listen. Thank you guys for watching, though. Hope you guys have a great Halloween. Let me know in the comment section what your favorite car was. And uh, see you guys in the next one. As always, it's your boy Saints fan. I'm out.